What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome to another Legacies review video. Today I'm going to be talking about Legacies Season 1, Episode 12. Now, just before I get into this, I did want to mention that I did a live reaction to this episode, so if you want to see me react live to it, there is a link in the description to my Patreon, uh, so you guys can go check it out. Also, like all my review videos, if you haven't watched the episode first, I do highly recommend that because there's going to be a lot of spoilers in this video. So if you don't want to be spoiled, go watch the episode first and then come back here. All right, I, <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be talking about much else outside of <laughs> Hope and Josie and Lizzie. Let's just quickly get into everything else because <laughs> like I'm, I'm, I'm going to die. <laughs> All right, just quickly, there was a mummy for the bad guy. They went to this, like, this town, this outside town. Um, they all got locked in. There was a lot of, like, plagues going on. Um, there was a lot of pretending to be married and being dating other people. So, yeah, I think the episode outside of what I'm going to spend most of this video talking about, it was fine. It was fine. It was a great episode. I mean, like I said, anything that has, you know, Lizzie, Josie, and Hope in it, all working together, I'm here for it. I just, it's a good episode. <laughs> so yeah, it was, um, it was, yeah, it was, it was a fun episode. The mummy was crazy, the bugs were gross, like the plagues were gross, I hated it, but like, it was good in the way that I hated it, if that makes sense. Oh, but I, oh. guys, so if you guys watch my reaction video, <laughs> reaction to is something that happens towards the end of this episode. I legit, like my eyes start watering. I'm legit on the verge of crying in my reaction and I don't understand <laughs> why my emotions are so triggered by this. <laughs> like I've rewatched that scene like three times now and each time I get emotional afterwards. You know what? I'm just going to replay it again. <laughs> It's the smile at the end of that scene. I can't. <laughs> I just, I cannot. I honestly, this this video is just going to be about that scene, honestly, because I cannot think of anything else outside of that scene. So what I'm talking about. <sighs> so the whole, the whole episode, like Lizzie is just going at Hope. And honestly, I love the sort of like Lizzie Hope, like, uh, I, enemies. But also, like, not quite enemies, you know? But it's not quite frenemies either. It's just, I love their dynamic. Like, they're just, like, they're so headstrong, both of them. And it's different between... It's different from, like, Lizzie and Penelope. How, like, it's more enemies, right? Um, but both Hope and Lizzie are just so headstrong that they're not going to, like, back down. Um, <laughs> but they've both got, like, missing information. So they're they're both just, like confused almost and so they're just like they just assume the other one is lying right so yeah the whole the whole episode lizzie is going at hope for like setting a, a fire in her room in her dorm um so lizzie and hope didn't go on like a spring break like right and she's like bringing up all these times that hope is just like like being mean to her and like just like ruining her life right and hope is just like i did none of those things what are you talking about and then like the whole episode josie is just like you know like what's the word like embarrassed or like guilty you know she's just got that sort of sulking look on her face the whole episode like she knows something oh and it all comes out at the end oh! <laughs> so like hope oh. Can I just say, I love Hope, like, in the car ride home, she's like, I would never say those things about you, Lizzie. You know, like, considering my my family history, I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if it started happening to me as well, you know? And I take those things very seriously, and I would never talk behind your back like that. Um, and Lizzie was like, you know what? I actually believe you. I, I believe you, but I, I'm confused why this all started and then they realize it was Josie that sort of planted that egg in Lizzie's brain and then they both sort of confront Josie at the end and be like why did you do this huh and she says she did it because she had a crush on her <laughs> I can't the scene is perfect like I said I've watched it multiple times it's too much it's too much <laughs> So she says that she had a crush on Hope <laughs> and that like 
Lizzie started calling her out on like, you know, her obsession with hope. And so Josie tries to like cover it up and be like, oh, how could I, how could I possibly have a, be obsessed or have a crush on someone that's so mean to my sister, right? Um, when she never was, but she also had written hope a note <laughs> and slipped it under her door, but she felt embarrassed by it. So she tried to like set it alight to destroy it, but she accidentally set the room on fire. And like I said, just like hope's realization and the smile between them both on the earth. So much. <laughs> I can't. Guys, I have said this since I started watching Legacies. <laughs> I am both a hosey and a posy shipper. But, but if I'm gonna be brutally honest, I feel like hosey is my OTP. I just, I don't know, there is something about them that just gets me. Since, what was it, was it episode two? I think even episode one, I was like, you know what? I kind of ship these two for like no reason. But then like as episodes went on, the reasons grew. Oh, I don't know. I just... <sighs> and obviously you guys saw my reaction to the sort of alternate universes episode that we had a couple episodes back where Hosey was like actually canon in one of those universes. And oh, I died. I died. But the fact that, like, Hosey is, like, like, almost canon, right, in this universe, oh, it just makes me so happy. I just... <laughs> like, I can't. I can't express how happy I am that, like, you know, Josie had a crush on her and Hope was just, like, happy about it, you know? She was happy about it. <laughs> I can't. Oh, no. <laughs> I just... I can't remember the last time I've been this on board a ship. You know, obviously I'm a shipper. I ship lots of couples. I'm a multi-shipper to no end because, you know, <laughs> on the flip side to this, I also still kind of ship Lizzie and Hope. <laughs> Like, I kind of love them together. They've got, like, such a unique, like, relationship. I kind of ship it. But <laughs> I, my feelings for Hosey are just so intense. I just want it so bad. <laughs> I don't know if it's ever going to happen. But I like that it's, like, actually, like, it's not just, like, oh, I'm making this up in my mind. Like, it's canon. Josie had feelings for hope at some point you know she that's something that happened it's canon in the show and it's like ho hope is clearly wasn't opposed to those feelings like like obviously we don't know if those feelings were ever reciprocated you know we don't know this at this point like in this reality hope could just be like oh it makes a lot of sense oh that's really sweet um and obviously Hope, you know, has caring feelings for Josie and they could just end at, like, friendship, right, for Hope. But the fact that she, you know, it, she wasn't, like, there, there was no negative reaction to finding out that Josie had a crush on her and then she, she, Hope was like, oh, you had a crush on me and Josie was like, of course I did. Who wouldn't? But honestly, who wouldn't? Ugh. It's too much. <laughs> so as you can tell, this episode has ruined me. <laughs> it's ruined me. Each episode, I swear to go, I swear to God, I go from hosey to posy to hosey. I just, I, what's the bet next week is going to be another like hardcore posy episode and I'm going to go down that rabbit hole again. I just, this show is too much. Just... <laughs> I just, yeah, I don't know. I just, there is something about Hosey. There is something about Hope and Josie. And I do feel like a lot of it is because, like, the actresses in real life, they're, like, super close in real life. And I love that. They're always on each other's, like, Instagrams or stuff like that. It's so cute. 
So I feel like their chemistry, like their real life chemistry that they have definitely like plays through into the show. And uh, I don't know. I just, I really want it. I really want Hosey. So bad. <laughs> so that's been my, it's not even been a review. Like, let's be honest. It's just been my like dying over Hosey. <laughs> So if you do want to see me like react live to that at that scene and the whole episode, uh, go check out my Patreon. Like I said, it's linked in the description. I legitimately start tearing up. Like I'm on the verge of crying during that scene. Like it just hit me so hard. <laughs> it's stupid, my reaction. Like, oh, but oh. It got me. It got me and I love it. So if you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. I just... Hosey. Hosey. <laughs> but yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye.